Hey guys, how are you? Sorry, we're just going to have to deal with the steering wheel because I'm in my car. Actually, I probably could have put you over on that side, but whatever. Um, if it bugs you, hooray. <laughs> so, I have a Dollar Tree haul. I'm just going to get into it. Thank you guys for liking, commenting, and subscribing, for stopping by. I don't like to say all that crap because it sounds like a broken record, but you know. <clears throat> but I got um, two of these boxes. I've, I've hauled these before. They are pretty nice size um, boxes. I know you can go to the post office, but I don't know. I just, I don't go to the post office. <laughs> I don't even like mail and stuff. Okay. At the, um, hanging on the register <clears throat> thing where it says your prices, I got two of these bags, one for me and one for the family member because they seem like they were really nice and sturdy. And what got me besides the flowers, was these polka dots. I love polka dots, okay? I, I I just, oh my gosh, look at that. Like, is that not like shabby chic or, I'm trying to show you with the flowers and the polka dots. Oh my gosh, greatest combination in the world. I should have bought all of them, but I did not. That's what I don't need. I'm trying to not even go in the Dollar Tree and buy stuff that I do not need because I'm dealing with crap and clutter and clutter and clutter and clutter and clutter okay <laughs> yeah Whew. If, if a nut house opened up next door i'd be the first one in line to go into it okay in the christmas section this says believe in the magic of christmas and of course i had to get it because of the believe i probably i don't know hopefully this is new because if it's not then i probably already have one so that was in that bag and then, um, uh, Gail, I don't know her name. I mean, I, that's her name, but I don't know her whole channel name, but she hauled these yesterday and she'll probably comment maybe, but she hauled these. Well, I watched her video yesterday. These are solar power Christmas lights and I'm kicking myself in the AW you know where because I did not get a few extra. I got two of each color, you know, cause so these are all the colors. These were right at the end of the register. Like, you know how the, where the register, where the cashier is, and then she has like a little bit of he or she has a little bit of room in the back. Well, right at the end of the register on the floor were these um, sitting. And these are supposed to be solar powered. So I guess you have to, yeah, you're gonna have to, I guess, unscrew this, I'm, I'm assuming. Yeah, it unscrews. Yeah, the light, I guess you just have to turn it on. Which it ain't turning on right now. I don't see a sensory tag, so that's kind of weird because usually these have a sensory tag. So, I got, like I said, two of each of those. That's an empty bag. I have Mr. Tonka truck next to me. I wasn't even going to say anything in my video, and now the steering wheel is getting on my nerves. Okay, I was looking for these at my big Dollar Tree a couple days ago, and I was asking my friend CJ if she had, if she knew, like, if they were making these anymore. Well, they have a smell. Um, because I had a, I don't know whether it was a curtain, I don't know what it was, but now it's not white anymore. So now I have to pretend that I'm like some kind of homemaker and learn how to re-dye this thing so it's back to white. I did not have one of these, and actually I didn't even think that what I put in the washer was gonna change it, you know, discolor it, so I don't really like the color it is now. It's a light color, but I really, and I thought I bought like three or four boxes of these when, um, <clears throat> when the store had, you know, when I saw them, but I can't find them. This was the only one that was in the Dagon store so I'm going to cut them in half and have, you get 10, so I'll, I'll get 20. So if I cut them in half and think about it. And then my little monkey sponge, I think he's a monkey. Um, I can't believe the Tonka guy got finished before you did. He was um, <clears throat> have you guys tried these? These are the microfiber cleaning pads. I, I'm using a lot of, you know, bleach and soap. Um, you know mixture and like the sponge the sponge is either that or it's getting torn you know like the spongy part 
is getting like the the monkey's face is like the scrubby and then these don't have the scrubby not that I really need it I like these are nice and soft like if you have a child or even an adult like myself with anxiety or whatever the hell's going on um, you know just the texture of these like they're fuzzy I'm not fuzzy fuzzy would you call that fuzzy what is it what is that that's is it fuzzy in the fuzzy hard. family yeah. but anyway so they're just cool like to squeeze and touch and whatever not to try to be gross or whatever okay and for those boxes again that um, Miss Gale had showed I got some drums I couldn't remember which one I had gotten and then I needed another one of I don't know whether it was the presents because I just felt like you didn't get enough but I saw the drums too and then ugh, I'm not going to talk about them older people y'all on the ignorance but they were really getting on my drumsticks. They were really, really, really getting on my drumsticks. Okay. <clears throat> I love these. I love these stackable drawers. These stackable drawers. Stackable organizing drawers. If you guys don't know what these are, you got to get them. These are hotter than Cheerios. Okay. Um, my, my friends, my awesome, amazing friend, and I love her anyway, but she had surprised the hell out of me. Uh, a couple years ago and I feel so bad for this because I had lost all her stuff okay but my amazing friend I could not find these and it took my store like a year after or whatever to finally get all the acrylic stuff in and my friend Echo her channel name is Akoya so go check her out and give her some love give her some give her some subs and some likes she does amazing stuff I don't know how she does it um and I don't know if she does videos because if she does I miss them um they don't come up but she had sent me a bunch of these you know in this big white box and so every time echo every time i see these i think of you but i have i'm gonna um i think yours is gonna be a two box um your stuff is gonna be in two in two two of these boxes i don't know if i want to do a big one and have every i'm because I, I got a couple breakable stuff so anyway can you hold these because now i'm about race knees I, I can't find the bag okay and then the last thing I got, I'm not even giving this person a shout out because I swear only certain people must give, you know, higher people up shout outs. So whatever. But anyway, so Yardley London Limited Edition Apple Blossom with cinnamon leaf oil. I don't know. I'm not really a cinnamon person. I watched. I'm just, oh my gosh. I am. I have been so exhausted, y'all. Um, and I'll explain that in a minute. Like it really matters. I feel like I need a booster seat like to see over the. Hold on. <clears throat> um, it didn't even dawn on me that the steering wheel is in the way. What was I going to say about this? Oh, so I watched a video and, and somebody was saying that they love the smell of cinnamon. And I'm like, ew. I really don't. But this, this smell reminds me. I don't know. It reminds me of something. But it really smells neat and weird and cool. Then I had to get. Can you hold that one? This is it, y'all. This is all that I got. Then I had to get one, two, five. Don't you love my counting? Can you guys see? I got five. Five of these. Why did I get five of these? I don't even know. I mean, I, Yardley, I know, is amazing. Did the cashier tell us that these are amazing? Like, yeah. I don't know. Like, she don't know me. She doesn't know me. Like, I buy the... I don't, I don't buy... I even like the almond. The something almond one or whatever. Um, but this one, y'all, is vanilla buttercream with clove leaf oil I don't know about no clove leaf but I'm all about vanilla so yeah I just mm -hmm. but my favorite I don't really like I don't really I don't know I mean it doesn't what was I, why did I want to lick this oh my gosh wouldn't that have been great <laughs> <laughs> okay sign me up now just to smell y'all y'all want to look at too don't blame it on me i don't care everybody blames everything on me i don't even know why i'm handing you that okay um so i forgot what i was going to tell you guys um um did you give me extra pickles okay Oh, I forgot to tell you because you didn't know if I wanted nuggets or... I don't know if I told you guys, but we're at Chick-fil-A. See, it's right behind us there. No, that's probably a tree. Um, but um, shh, the rustling. What are you starving? I'm 
kind of. <laughs> That's a dumb question to ask a man. He's hungry all the daggone time. No. Um, so basically, yesterday, I was working downstairs. I've been working everywhere. You know, I've been trying to work in my room. Could you stop, dude? The rustling, they're not going to hear me, and I can't focus. You want me to dump it out? No. There. Now they're going to call me a witch, and I don't give a poop. Anyways, move your hand out of my space. Is that that cute man? I'm going to so go over there and invite myself over to his life. No. It's not. Or that's another truck. That's another okay. truck. Okay. That's not the Budweiser no. whatever man. Okay, it's getting hot up in here. Um, maybe he likes big girls. Yeah. Okay, so anyways. You're right pushing it. <laughs> Push. Um... Oh, oh no, he's too short. No, he doesn't even he doesn't even have a butt. Okay, huh. so yes, I have to get on Eric's nerves. Um, but I have been working like I am. I have just I don't know. My family member keeps asking me how in the heck. But how does she say it? How do you have so much stuff? How did it get here? Huh. And I just get really frustrated because I'm like. Well, you know, not all of this stuff is my stuff. Like, there's stuff, there's other people's stuff mixed up in my stuff. So then it looks like I do have a lot. Yes, I do have a lot of stuff. Okay, I'm not going to lie. You know, I don't, I don't feel like I owe anybody, even my own family member, an exclama explanation. Okay, but, um, you know, like I said, I was in, when I, I, since I was 15 years old, I have been basically buying my own stuff for working in the daycares. Well, it probably got a little bit more, maybe 17-ish or 16, whatever. Whenever I got my own classroom, you know, and kids, um, you know, I probably bought my own things. Um, I don't even, that was so long ago, I don't even remember. My second job, I definitely had to. And then my third job, you know, I kind of... Um, you know, well, I probably had all the things, but anyways, and then, like I told you guys, when I found, and I'm going to tell myself, but when I found out about the Dollar Tree, you know, website, not the Dollar Tree website, like not .com, but there was Dollar Tree hauls, you know, people doing hauls and stuff was from this um, lady and she was only telling me about it in the, in the, one of the Dollar Trees because of the craft aisle. Oh my gosh. Where are them things at? Cause I can really smell them things. Um, because apparently, you know, I'm a big girl. I have a big mouth. My voice must be loud at times. And, whew, Jesus, I'm going to be knocked out by them dang things. Oh, they're right here. Whoo. Good golly. Mm. They have a horrible smell. You know, it's very perfumey. It's getting on my nerves. Um, I can't focus. But anyway, so then when I found the group, okay, one of my friends can relate to me because she's doing it now. Um, or been doing it, but it's all good. You know, we'll learn and I'm learning and I'm like, I, I, I keep telling myself how stupid I am because one time, so basically when I found this woman, I was making a list, you know, I'm watching all these people. Oh, I got to find that. Oh, I got to find that. I like that. Whether it was hairspray or eyeshadows, like if they have the elf eyeshadow, I had to buy all the colors. Okay. Didn't use eyeshadow. Um, I mean, at some point in my life, I stopped. I'm like, Kim, you're ugly. It ain't going to do no good. You don't need no damn eyeshadow, you know, or like all the lipsticks. Now, now, okay, all the lipsticks, I would not buy all the lipstick colors because I don't use all the colors. Like, I ain't going to rock red. I ain't going to rock purple, yellow, whatever, unless I'm like going crazy. <laughs> if I keep nodding my head, I'm going to pass out. Um, but like, they had this one big, I don't know if you guys remember the tall bottle of, um, hairspray it was and then somebody had come on and said you know you had the youtubers that would do the research and they were like oh this is eleven dollars okay my dumb self okay i watched my words good job kim went out and bought 11 or 12 bottles of this hairspray because it was eleven dollars and i'm getting it for a dollar and i'm thinking i'm going to um what do you call it stockpile it or whatever because i guess at that time i was using a lot of hairspray 
Okay, I went to use one. It stunk. It smelled so rotten and so raunchy, I did not know what to do with myself. And I'm thinking, well, maybe it just stinks to high heaven when you spray it, and then maybe later on it gets better. <laughs> no. I Then I went out, I went, you know, downstairs or wherever I had it, and I got another bottle. And I'm shaking it, and I'm praying, and I open it, and it's the same stinking smell. I kept it. I kept it. I did not use it. I threw those two bottles away. And then finally, I'm like, you know what, Kim? These other eight bottles or whatever, you know, nine bottles probably stink. And you just wasted that money. I'm like, whatever. So, and then I used to always buy things in threes or fours. And I hear people that do that. You know, they buy three, you know, things like, like I would go and buy three packages of these or two packages. Now, if I'm like right now, and I'm so proud of myself because I've gotten out of doing that. Now, some things I do, you know, like the container, the, the Santa cookie plastic container that you're sitting on. I bought all of them. I bought three. Um, but anyways, I mean, I just got called up. You know, I got called up. I wanted to fit into the world, you know, of YouTube when I did it. And... You know, I, I just couldn't help it. I'm not trying to blame it on nobody because it was my own self and my own stupidity. I couldn't even do hauls then, you know, because I didn't know how to. I didn't know how to. I don't know how to do all that stuff. You know, I'm lucky I can get the computer to do what I wanted to do, you know, to get on Facebook. To, I mean, you would laugh at me trying to watch me look at my Gmail. I don't know how the hell to do the Gmail. I can't even get into my, my, my um, regular email because it wants all these passwords and passcodes and you know, wants me to go to Eric's phone that he doesn't even have, you know, his old number and get a number and I can't even break that or, and then I said, I don't have any access. And then it comes back telling me, well, I'll try again. So anyways, but so because I have, I mean, long wooden story to tell you, but you know, basically, you know, I'm not really, I'm not really hauling a lot of stuff. I'm not, you know, trying to go and shop and buy a lot of stuff, you know, because it's cute. Sorry, the solar lights, they just are cute and amazing. Um, but I'm just, my, my hauls are going to be far and few, you know, in between because, um, you know, I'm just trying to declutter and I'm trying to, you know, normal people do it, you know, in the spring or, you know, whatever I'm doing it right now. And then basically what happened last night, my cousin must think I'm mental because I was asking, I put on Facebook that I was asking the dear Lord, you know, to bring me my mama J to bring me my grandma K. Basically grandma K is, was my neighbor who I took care of. Um, because the dear Lord had sent her, you know, to me because two weeks ago that time I didn't want to be in the world. And then a week or whatever it was later, two weeks later, whatever it was. And then she called me, my neighbor, I call, we call her grandma K. Um, her name is Jessie May, but, um, she had called me and was like at 11 o'clock at night, either 10 or 11. And it was like, Kim, can you go to the store for me? And I'm like, sure. So me and my family member hops in the car and we went, got her list and went down there and got her everything that she needed. And I had like 10, 15 bags and, and I took care of her until she died. Um, now, why the hell I brought that up, I have no idea. Um, why did I bring that up? I don't know where my mind's going, y'all. I'm going in tree branches. There's a connection, but I can't remember why the connection was. But um, I'm trying to think. I might have to pause the video so I can think of what the hell the connection of bringing her up was for. Oh, my Facebook post. So, um, and then taking care of her and hanging out with her, I met her niece, which was Mama J, Juanita. Um, and she literally, like, turned into a mom to me. So basically, on my Facebook post, I was asking the Lord to send me an angel because I really needed help, you know, um, you know, with, with my other family member, you know, passing and not being here. I feel like I have no protection. I, I feel like I have nobody that's on my side. And if I keep talking about it, I'm going to cry. and I'm not going to keep talking about it. So that was what my prayer was because I felt like I needed, you know, I needed guidance. I needed help. I needed whatever. Um, 
but so it's it's not that I don't want to do YouTube but I just don't and I'm you know the, the, I can't even look at the numbers anymore because when they drop all the way down and then they go all the way up and they go all the way down and it's just really pissing me off thinking it's on my nerves so I tell myself don't look at the numbers but so there's not really going to be I mean I don't really want to keep bringing stuff in um you know, unless I'm really, really, really going to use it. And I hope to goodness I even make these containers because I still even haven't made my wreath. And here we are in November. You know, I hate cutting that mesh. I hate that it's all wriggly raggly. And do they even eat? Um, oh, sorry, I just got a saw like these toothpick legs in my mirror. Um, so, you know, that's why my, my hauls aren't, you know, they're not like bam, bam, bam. You know, it's like, Maybe here, maybe here's one month, <laughs> you know, or a couple months later. So that's basically it, guys. Um, I didn't mean to make this go 20 minutes, but I just wanted to, you know, run my mouth, share some of my life. Um, so, yeah, and then last night I noticed, or was it, was it yesterday that I noticed it? I think it was yesterday. I was working on my area, my section, in front of our fur. Well, not in front of the furnace, but I was diagonal from the furnace. And um, because I was under the light where I could see, I was going through a box. I cleared out two boxes. I've already donated, what, two, two bags to the lady that we um, donate to. And then I'm working on a third bag for her. Um, and then I, then I don't know what the hell I'm trying to else think, but I noticed that our, our, what was I going to say? Refrigerator. Yes. Our refrigerator doesn't have water either. Um, <laughs> but that's in the kitchen. I have no clutter in the kitchen that I know of. Um, except for my food. My, my food is cluttered to everybody. Um, but anyway, so, um, our, our furnace does drip out of one spot but now it's dripping there's this other tube or or whatever the hell you call it pipe. Pipe, uh, yeah pipe. pipe pipey thing and that's now dripping and that wasn't dripping before so I had to tell my family member that luckily the guy was the, thank god I even cleared out the section for him to get by because we had a cabinet pushed over here and then I had a four drawer thing over there and I was able to luckily I was working on those bins and I was able to push everything back I mean, you talk about, you know, I'm not good at doing that. I've never been good at like being like all misorganized and miss perfect and able to go through everything and everything in its place and politically correct and alphabetized. And if you are, I'm jealous. Okay. I mean, I always, I always say that I need that lady from Bewitched, you know, wiggle my nose and poof, everything's perfect and fantastic. You know, there's not, I even have dust on my dashboard. My inside of my mirrors have needed to be cleaned for years, you know? Um, but anyways, I don't know. I don't know if that helps me vent and, and, and release that stuff and tell you guys, I don't know. It's just a shame, but I mean, I have to, and I have to fight, you know, because I feel like I've done nothing. You know, I feel like when I go through stuff that I make it worse and I have to, t and then by the time I want to go in my room and lay down and try to watch videos, I'm halfway falling asleep. I mean, yesterday I got up at nine something and I didn't even get much sleep and I worked until what a long time, wasn't it? It was probably in the dark, like at least until what almost probably almost seven because him and I went to see if the lady had or the man where we dropped the stuff off if she had um, if they had put it in their trailer because I'm not trying to donate you know, my clothes and stuff to you and blankets and pillows. And then you're just going to leave them outside. It's like no compadre. No. So, um, I know that wasn't even the right word, the right Spanish word. <laughs> anyway, I just sound like it just went with what I was saying. I thought somebody was knocking on my window. Um, so anyway, I don't know. I'm just sharing guys, but that's what I've been doing. I have been trying to work and then you know, when Eric gets money, then he gets to send out a package for me. Um, I was so excited because I remembered I had the markers for CJ and Bethy and I just found them in the back of my car. I need to, I need to even go through my car and make sure, um, that's probably where the other markers are that I can't find, um, that I wanted to use for a project. But anyway, 
So, I can't apologize. You know, this is my video. I, I did not, you know, I will try to tell you when, you know, um, you know, when it stops. So, you guys don't have to listen to all this BS if you don't want to. But, you know, I just wanted to come on and explain what I'm going through. I'm going through my own hell. It almost makes me not even want to shop or, you know, not buy something. Now, I do want to find the little um, Lemonade Mom. I think that's her channel name. Vanessa. I, I love her. I, she showed a little bathtub and it's got like three little bath bombs. I do want to get one of each of those colors, but I couldn't find those. So I was kind of bummed. They really didn't have much in the smaller one. It's, And then they got this woman where she acts like she's stocking, you know, stacking, stocking. So it's so funny. It's like you're just, you know, you're just touching stuff and moving stuff around. You're not like putting something in a box. Why? Oh, I was like, why is there a leaf? on my dashboard but it was in the shape of a heart but now it's not it's in like pieces um but anyway y'all I'm gonna go before I sneeze and you know Cinderella has to go and go to sleep I'm not Cinderella I just so, have to work I work the night shift anyways you don't argue with the boss Yes, in my relationship, I'm the boss, okay? I am the king, the queen, the prince, the princess. You know, we are so close to Dollar Tree. I will go get that them baseball bats. Um, oh, what was in the Dollar Tree? Dang it. Just, uh, just saying the baseball bats, there was something in there that I didn't get. But anyways, I don't know what it was. Um, and then something that you had seen... You had showed me, but I don't, even, <laughs> I don't even remember what that was. But, yeah. Um, okay, guys. So, I'm going to get Eric. And then he just threw pickles that he had for me on the floor. Off with his head. No. Now, now we're going to be um, <laughs> when you got your Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> off with his head. Capiche. Yeah, I was waiting, waiting. Nada. <laughs> anyway. No, I'm going to go. And I'll talk to y'all later. And I hope you guys have a blessed Thursday. I can't believe it's Thursday already. Can y'all? It's just insane. But, um, and hopefully, oh, just to let you guys know, hopefully my thing doesn't cut off. If it does, thank you guys for hanging out with me and listening to all this mess. But to let you guys know, I'm really feeling that my blood pressure medicine and my, even though it's 10 milligrams and my fluid slash blood pressure medicine is a little tiny pill. I don't know if it's both of them, but I really feel like they're giving me these anxiety attacks. I, I maybe because I'm taking them both at the same time, like instead of taking the one and then I would take the other one, I'm taking them both like just shoving them in my mouth like normal people take like 10 pills at a time apparently my body doesn't like that so I don't know I don't know if I'm damned if I do damned if I don't I don't know if I'm going to screw my own body up you know not taking them anymore but the one day that I didn't take them um I was fine you know I did have an issue at night it wasn't as bad it was scary to me because they come on in different forms in different waves I don't know, y'all. I just don't know. But anyway, I'm going to go. And um, I hope you guys have a blessed one. It's nice out. It almost looks like it wants to rain in some areas, but I don't know. So I'm going to go and um, hope all is well with everybody. Thanks for hanging out with me and listening to my mess. And if you guys have any tips or tricks or if you guys, you know, fight with yourself and get depressed on trying to organize and clean, then I'm right with you. You know, pound it. You know what I mean? Um, at least you're not alone because I do it every day. I feel like a workhorse. It's like, I feel like Cinderella, like, uh, but anyway, I'm probably going to have to go home and do it again. I'm just thinking about it. I'm going to puke. So, okay guys, I'm going to go, I'm going to shut up and I, um, I'll talk to you guys whenever. I don't know. Whenever I get to go somewhere or, you know, I don't know. And okay, I guess that's it. Bye.